Fred Miller, Master Mind Mapper here. Mind mapping is the Swiss Army knife for the brain. It's the consummate tool for strategic planning, problem solving, decision making, process development, brainstorming, and a host of other brain related activities. Before we look at some examples, let's take a look at why mind mapping is a better way than just, well, the old project way. You used to grab a piece of paper, line paper, and write project at the top and then proceed with Roman numeral 1, A, B, C, and so on, until you got to about 3B and realized, oops, that should be 1C. The problem with going linear is you're trying to organize thoughts before you develop them. Our brains don't work that way. Mind mapping brings together the creative right and linear left sides of our brain. It's the way our brains work. And when we use mind mapping, we can do all of these things. Let's look at a few examples. Mind mapping starts in the middle of the page and everything radiates from the center. And you can do all the things we talked about, strategic planning, problem solving, process development, all kinds of things. So let's take a look at one of these. Let's take a look at strategic planning. If a company is going to do a strategic plan, it's going to include a variety of things. Products and services, competition, economic conditions, prospecting, sales, and so on. Let's look at just one of those. Let's look at HR issues. There could be a mind map coming off just HR issues. Because you're going to want to talk about compensation, training, testing, hiring, and quite a few other things. Hiring alone could trigger another mind map. Things would include a bounty program to try to find good employees, using employment agencies, the classifieds, school placement office. The cool thing about mind mapping is that literally and figuratively, everything can be on the same page. You're going to come out with far more ideas and solutions to everyday problems and opportunities by using mind mapping. Let's continue working on this mind map and look at another one of the issues. We could look at competition, prospecting, sales. Let's look at cash flow. Cash flow could be caused by a number of problems, but one way to improve it would be COD. Another way, email the invoices when the product goes out, have a strict policy of calling after 10 days, and maybe they have to put on a credit card before they even buy it. But the fact is, again, everything is on the same page. Now, here's something I really like about this program. Mind map is a good way to develop things, but it can get a little bit wild. In the corporate world, they like organization charts. Is that slick? Just one more thing I can do with this program. And so it comes back to our mind mapping, the Swiss Army knife for the brain that we use for strategic planning, problem solving, decision making, process development, brainstorming, and a host of other brain related activities. I hope you become as impassioned as I am about this product. I wish you the best. I'm Fred Miller, Master Mind Mapper.